it's nothing new But it's so good to see you We do this every day And I'm still so amazed by you My name is Devin and welcome to another video from the Egan family and today I have a really fun homeschool find to share with you. This is one of our daughter Emery's Christmas presents that we found for her on Amazon. Of course it will be linked in the description box but it is my preschool busy book for ages three and up from play learn create happy toy official at outlook.com and this is amazing. Emery, for those of you who don't know, will be three in March. And so she's not quite at this three plus, but she can already do the first half of this book with confidence. And so we're really super excited to share this with you, especially for those of you who are trying to entertain multiple age groups at the same time. So let me open this up. So your kit comes with all of these dry erase markers with the erasers attached. And you'll see where those will come in handy in a little bit. It also comes with all of this information. It tells you like what it includes. Um, there's a little hair over here. Don't mind that. A little bit more about the company and all of those sorts of things. Um, yeah, there's that if anybody is interested. Then it also comes with, where did they go? Oh, here they are. It comes with additional Velcro for some of the pieces. So if you lose any, it does come with some to replace them. And then it comes with this nice little packet here. So if you want to take this on the go, you can put any of the pieces in here to keep it safe. And then this is the book. So it has this nice plastic cover and then this is all glossy. So you can write on them with these. So if you just wanna give this to your child and have them color this in and then erase or whatever, you can work on color matching where you color the picture under here and make them color the outside one the same color, anything like that, or just let them scribble if you just need a few minutes by yourself. So then, like I said, we get into the book. And the first page goes over colors. And so all of these little crayons lift off. And Emery has already played with this page a bunch. You know, I just mix them up for her and say, okay, Emery, can you find me the black? And then she can put all of these back where they go. And I can even let, get, like just peel all these off and give them to her and she can do that on her own. So that is the first page. And the next page is the alphabet and the same thing. So this one doesn't match colors. They actually have to look at the letters and match them up. And it does have uppercase and lowercase on each one. So that we love. The next page, my number is one through 10. Plus it has the plus sign, minus sign, multiplication, division, and equal sign. And the same thing, it is not colored underneath. So she does just have to look and match. This page Emery loves. Um, she's not that great at it yet. Like I said, she's not even three. But it is not only do you have to match the number, but also what part of the picture. And when you are completed, you make this beautiful rainbow. Of course, she loves that. The next page we're looking at is shapes. So this one, once again, you don't match color. You just match shape. So that is pretty neat. This next page is matching big and small. So you get, are given both of these. Okay, which one's the small one? Which one's the big one? This page, ooh, oh no. Come on little teepee. This is weather, sorry, there we go. This is weather and season. Which is very interesting. 
These she hasn't gotten into yet, but she's ab absolutely going to love this. We love talking about weather. She loves looking outside and telling me what the weather is going to do. So this is, like I said, super cool. And then another one for the weather, it's match the corresponding item to the weather. So this is as she gets a little bit more advanced. So when it's raining, you'll need your umbrella. And this doesn't have clues as the kids have to figure it out. When it's sunny and hot out, you'll need a fan. The rainbow matches the rainbow ice cream. When it's winter, you'll need a scarf. If there's a storm outside, you should go inside. And if it's windy, then you can fly a kite. So this one requires a little bit more critical thinking. So this is as she gets more advanced. So it is nice that this book can grow with her and she can pick and choose what she wants to do in the meantime. And then this one is, I know the parts of my face. So it says ear and this one you can match the pictures too. Not the colors, just the pictures. And there are ear arrows, so they don't have to be able to read them, even if they're having a hard time figuring out the pictures. There's an arrow pointing to which part of the body they are talking about. And this is sorting vegetables and fruits. This one, once again, has the picture, but not the color. So they really have to look at the details of the picture because they don't look carefully. An orange, an apple, and a pumpkin look, can look pretty similar. So, and the watermelon, the orange, and the cat, you know, they can all look pretty similar. There's a lot of same shapes, so they have to really pay attention to the details for those little ones. Keep not pressing them down hard enough. <laughs> And then we have um, uh, land, air, and water transportation. So this one does have what the name of it is and the picture of it. Once again, no colors match, but then they can, you know, you talk about what, okay, which one of these looks like it would fly in the sky? Which one of these would drive on a road? Which one of these would go underwater, on the water or underwater? So that's a really great way to introduce different names of vehicles. Like I said, it does say the name. So when, you know, your child matches it up, you can say, oh, that's right. Good job, Emery. That is the helicopter. And this page she adores because she loves animals. And once again, there are pictures, grayscale pictures for you to match up with. Super, super cute. And this is really, oh, why do I keep doing this? And this is really great when you get into like calendar time, Monday. There's all the days of the week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. These days, the read, picnic, sport, game, park, party, and vacation are not, there's not pieces to peel up. So those are just down there. So you can just discuss what those are. And then these are all of the celebrations for the months of the year. So once again, when you talk about January, you say happy new year, February, Valentine's Day, so on and so forth. So very cute to learn all of the months of the year. And this one here is a family favorite. If you didn't know, we love outer space. And so this is the match the planet um, activity. And yes, this one does also say underneath what the planet's name is. So yes, very cute. Like I said, this does will grow with your child. So if you have um, a two and a half or three year old or even a little bit younger could probably do some of the other match, the beginning matching. And even if they can't, like I said, it's just, it's a nice way to introduce it. Um, but it will grow with a child. And that is the end of the book. So like I said, this was such a great find for us. I believe when we purchased it, it was about $20. I think 
and I have seen it go all the way up to $30. But like I said, I will link it in the description box below. We are already getting a whole bunch of use out of this and I can just see us getting more and more and more use as she gets older. And this is what a great tool to have while Parker is doing homeschool. This makes her feel like she actually has an activity to do. Um, she is only like two and a half, so she doesn't have the attention span to actually sit down and do schoolwork, nor would I expect that from her at her age. So this is just a perfect way to introduce some of these learning um, foundations that we really would like her to, ha to have and to build upon while still being fun and age appropriate. This is never required of her. It's more of a game, a learning tool, and she is more than welcome to pull this anytime that she would like to. So it's no pressure if she doesn't want to do this. It's not like a curriculum. We don't force that on her at her age. Um, so yeah, this, we were extremely thankful to find this. She, like I said, is especially loving this page already. She thinks it is so cool to do this. She thinks she is so cool to be just like her brother. And so I had to share it with you for any of you that have little ones that, um, and your homeschool parents, or even if you're not, if you just want to find a way to introduce something like this to your child, we absolutely love this book. And there are a few different versions online. I think that, um, you can buy some with like the end pages are a little different. So like I said, I will link the seller that we got this from in the description box. We are so, so, so happy with the quality. These are, um, they're thicker pieces. Like it's, I'm bending pretty hard and it's, it's hard to actually damage them. And our Emery is our little wild girl. So if you know anything about her, you know that if some, one of our kids was going to break it, it would be her. And, uh, she has not broken it. So that is a good indication that it's holding up all right. So I hope that you found this quick little video informative. If you have any questions about this book, you would like me to go into something in more detail. You would like to see pictures of something. As always, let me know in the description box or send me a message on Instagram. I'm pretty responsive over there and I love to help you out in any way that I can. So if you're not following us over there, you should head over there and uh, so we can be friends. You can see more uh, daily pictures and stories of our kids over there. We have a lot of fun um, on our Instagram and our stories. And yeah, so thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that it was helpful. If you are new here, please consider subscribing. We share all sorts of videos on this channel from cleaning to organization, motherhood, lifestyle, and homeschool videos, pretty much everything in between. So if any of those things are of interest to you, stick around and subscribe. And for those of you who are returning subscribers, we appreciate you so, so, so much and are so thankful to be bringing you into the new year with us. And we hope to be able to bring you tons more content this year. As always, if you have any requests, leave them in the comments and we will see you next time. Happy new year, everyone. Bye. Or as Parker would say, peace. Again, again, why did nobody tell me? I film a video just showing you my hands and I forget to put on my wedding rings. Don't tell my husband. Bye. <laughs>